Welcome back, welcome back. Watch me attempt this style on my boyfriend. And also we're gonna talk about his scalp and how to cleanse his scalp the proper way. This is the style that we're doing. So first off guys, what I am doing is I'm going through and just scraping off the debris off his scalp. He just has really dry scalp. And to me, I feel like he just doesn't wool his scalp. But, you know, that's more farther things that we're going to talk about. But his scalp has always been um, very sensitive to certain products and stuff. So also he did get his hair dyed. So that's probably another reason why his scalp is super dry. Y'all, I tell him a million times, please moisturize your scalp. Just because you got locks does not mean that you cannot moisture your scalp. Like, I tell him this millions of times. But who's going to listen to me? And I'm his girlfriend. So, that's what I'm doing. Just getting off the debris. And y'all going to see all of that stuff just fall all down. Even it's in, like, his, um, his haircut. Like, I just don't understand. And in me, I just feel like maybe it's just, you know, it could just be other things. But... I wish that he could go to the doctor and check, but he probably won't, y'all. So, what I have to do is I have to just go a little bit harder than what I'm doing. And, you know, detox his scalp. And that's what I'm about to do next. So, alright, y'all. So, what I am doing is I'm about to grab the Design Essential product. It does have peppermint and witch hazel in it, I believe. But if I am mistaken... I will drop the products down below so you guys can know what exactly I'm using. It's basically the same products I've been using, but for today, I'm just doing like a little scalp cleanser and, you know, giving the scalp a fresh, you know, fresh air and just everything that needs to be done to the scalp. I probably want to do a detox on him just because the color might fade. So I'm just doing it this way. And, you know, he get his hair done every month, so... It shouldn't be a problem. And then also, I would be um, showing you guys how to do the shampoo process for him just because it's a little bit different. I do use some of the products that um, another hairstylist taught me, so I'm not going to take 100% credit of it. But I am using Seabreeze and Tea Gel on him. And like I said, I will drop those products down below so you guys can understand. But those products are really good for, you know, sensitive scalp locks anything so i'm not going to take 100 percent credit for the products i am using for him at the shampoo bow so i just wanted to verify that to you guys also guys i will be using the steamer on him you guys did see in the first clip but that steamer does help open up his scalp and just give him even more moisture that he needs and i try to do that as often but sometimes he be ready to go so yeah this man gets freestyles all the time, so sometimes he just be grumpy, and I'll just be trying to get done faster, but today he let me do all of that, so I was happy. All right, guys, I'm going to finish up shampooing his hair, and I'm also going to give him a deep conditioner at the end, so yes, we'll talk in the next clip when I start to do his hair.
also guys please if you have any questions or problems please drop down below if i didn't touch base on something please let me know and if you want to see something different let me know tell me everything that you want me to know guys i do not mind and also guys if you are new here welcome and if you have been here solely riding with me thank you please like this video please comment show some love please subscribe y'all please keep me going we need to get up to a thousand subscribers so i am going to work as hard as possible also for this week and next week i will be dropping five different videos just because I am a little bit behind on a couple of videos. So you will see five different videos. If not, you'll see four. But you'll see five for right now. And then after those two weeks, you'll go back down to four. So you guys got a little surprise in between. So I just want to let you guys know that ahead of time. All right. So I already sprayed his scalp down with some moisturizing spray. All I'm doing is just retwisting his hair. Like I said, y'all, I will drop down below what products I am using. And as you can see, his scalp does not have none of that flakiness or debris on his scalp anymore. The um, detox or stuff that I did use did clear it up. So, yes, I just wanted to let you guys see the difference between his scalp versus now to then. But, yes, y'all, all I'm doing is just retwisting his hair. And I'll come back on here once I get to the next step.
y'all i'm just moosing him down to give him a little bit stronger hold up top just because that area does get frizzy fast and i am popping him under the dryer for 15 minutes he does hate this process hello i feel like everybody hates this process but me personally i don't care you're going under there regardless so yes and then after that i'm just about to um put the style in that he wants he wants little baby braids, so that's what I am doing. Um, I feel like I should have made some of his braids a little bit smaller, but we'll do that next time when he asks for this style again. And y'all, yes, I use a wig cap to dry him a little bit differently. <laughs> but that's what I do to all of my men when they have braids, just to lay the hair down flatter. You already know I'm about to oil that scalp with my oil. So, yes, y'all, I gave him a bottle and i don't even think he barely uses it so i have to do this and when he comes to me i oil his scalp but when i'm not with him i don't know what he's doing but now his scalp looks all nice and clean and fresh a little bit of redness but that's okay and i'm going to tell him please tie your hair down and if you don't tie your hair down we're going to have a problem <laughs> but yes y'all this is the final look Please stay tuned for the next. You already know after this video, there's another video dropping. So y'all, please keep it coming. Show this video some love. And you guys have a good one. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.